Hello guys, Arder here with 5 more random tracks from this week posted in Discord channel. And first track, as you can see, called Jet Flight. It's not exactly track or like legit track, because as you can see, you can finish it in less than 3 seconds. But it's more like, I would say, training ground which you can use for training your flying skill with no particular goal. Oh yeah, I forget to mention, and this is a great uh, opportunity. Uh, right now, after last update, all soulbox have opportunity to fly in specific condition, which author could create. So these all four tracks you can use for uh, training your flying skill. They have all different speed. So yeah, go ahead and train your flying skill in Zipkist. And until I'm flying to the end of this map, uh, please consider to subscribe and put like into this video. Thanks! So let's switch to track number two, which called Corkscrew. First, let's go and see it in photo mode, just to see this level itself and all its scenery. Nothing special, just upside down pipe, then turn where you can fall and crash, but huh, probably, as you can see here, this is a possibility to cut this corner and jump right into the next section of this track. Okay, so yes, finish not so hard, you just need to jump at the end, which potentially not so hard. While I try many attempts, I found another small cut here. Then transition into the loop, which end with the upside down pipe. And there is enough speed to have this jump with arms up, which potentially can save you time and go to the next big loop. And there is the most tricky moment in all this map, where you just need to aim into the last corkscrew, let's call it this way. And yeah, there is no problem at all to finish this. Maybe you can cut even more if you will try to aim and jump into the finish itself, but I didn't try it, I just want to finish it legit, with new after time, which is less than a minute, so hooray me. And let's go to the track number 3, which call Birdhouse, and I don't know how randomizer work, because first map really helped me all this training to go into this map where again you need to fly through all five checkpoints that around the tree and the finish is inside the bird house i guess this is how it's called so let's try and see what my time is oh yeah forget to mention this is a first point of view so potentially it could be easier for someone to go and do it there is no specific trajectory to do all of them. If you're really expert on flying, it's easy for you. But for me, it was hard to do the last one because again, you can hit any object on the tree and you will die because as you can see, there is like really, really fast speed. So let's take it easy. We have a plenty of time. Nice, 46.9. And next track, Gloom V1. Okay, you know, it's really looks like Trackmania vibes, you know? When I see all these jumps, all these moments, all these not full half pipe, half jumps, uh, side jumps, uh, wall rides, basically every element uh, 
looks like a uh, track from Trackmania, which is really great. I didn't play much in the last Trackmania, but I played in the old one version. I don't remember which one. There are a couple of them, so yeah. It's not really hard as I think, but it's really interesting from the idea of Trackmania. Again, it's only my opinion, so no offense. Okay, let's go and try a full speed jump. You need to aim here to not uh, hit the obstacle on the road. Then loop with a jump. Transition to the wall ride. With another jump, transition to the checkpoint, wall ride. And here's, as you probably notice, from the right side there is, I would say it's called risky finish. I took the normal one, which is slower even than bronze medal. So game or author made you go to the risky finish, which I will try to do so. Spoiler alert, I didn't make it. I tried a couple of times and I'm still not on level where I can easily finish it with the risky finish. But I believe there are a lot of players who can easily done it. So you can go here and you need to jump to the finish, which I didn't do. Okay, and the next track, Construct Towers, which on first glance looks like a pretty easy one. I don't know, Random God is really on my side this week, because I don't see any really hard tracks. At least I could finish them, not like after medal or gold medal, but it's great. I like to <laughs> finish tracks. So yes, this track's not hard. I would say it's more like classical track, I would say. Not a lot of hard moments, just one wall right where you can uh, hit and lose the wheel but all other you just need to take your ideal trajectory to not lose speed okay there is a pipe from the first point of view which really help you not to crash it's not switch your uh, steering and i think this is the last part of the track and again nothing really hard here i i think there's could be some possibilities to cut or cheat but you need to find because there are a lot of checkpoints And still with some luck, gold medal, I'll take that. Okay, guys, yeah, so this was the five tracks from this week. Thanks for watching it. Thanks. If you enjoyed it, please put likes. If you want to see tracks from the last week, you can watch it here on the pop-up video. Thanks. Bye.